Hello everybody, this is Hubert with Traveling with Hubert. This is uh, April the 9th, 2022. Uh, we're bringing you a video today of another uh, town in South Georgia that at one time was doing fairly well, but it's not doing so well anymore. Uh, we went to Pitts, Georgia. And I have a little history with Pitts, Georgia. I pastored a church there for two years, the Pitts United Methodist Church. Uh, when I was there, uh, there was a Dr. Delano Brazil that was doing his best to revitalize the community. And we talk about it in the video. Uh, but those, those efforts seem to have not produced much fruit. But as I was there a while back, I uh, found something, someone else who's also trying to do that. And uh, that is uh, Valerie and Clay Oliver. They have a farm there and they have started uh, uh, making oils. And they specialized in cold pressed nut and seed oils. Uh, they, they have pecan oil, they have sunflower oil. But the one that caught my attention is the. Uh, the uh, uh, okra seed oil. I haven't tried it, but it's on my to-do list to do. And uh, I understand that it's very, very tasty and, and improves the flavor of your salad dressings. And if you brush it on your steak, it'll give it a different taste. Uh, as always, when we do a video, we ask you to uh, subscribe to the channel. We ask that you hit that thumbs up button to give us a like. And we ask that if you, there's something that you'd like to share or some question you'd like to ask, uh, to leave us a comment in the comment section. And I understand some people, um, I've been told this, that they watch on their smart TV and they can't do those things. Um, but if you have access to a computer, uh, you, you can do those things from your computer. Uh, but we appreciate those who subscribe. We appreciate everybody who watches. And, and our, our wish always is that you have just a blessed day. Now at the end of this video, there will be four recipes uh, from um, Oliver Farm. And um, they look, look very, very tasty. So, come along with us as we travel to Pitts, Georgia and Oliver Farms. Church of God, honey. We're just going to ride through town a little bit and then we're going to come back to a uh, little Oliver Farm store up here. The station. Okay. Right here, honey. The station. We're just going to ride through town a little bit, look around, see what's here. Yeah. Remember, we talk about communities that were thriving one time and aren't thriving so much anymore. They got a parks place here. It says open. The old school. That old school looks like it. Yeah. Well, do they have a school here now? I don't think so, honey. I think they all go to uh, Rochelle to school. Because this is in Wilcox County. How far is Rochelle? About 10 miles.
lake right there, honey. Now we're on the other side of the tracks. Yeah. I hope it's not the wrong side of the tracks. No way. Nice pecan orchard. They should get some pretty good sail service. There's a tower. Mm -hmm. Oh, we're going right through the middle of the cemetery, honey. It's on both sides of the road. Well, it's pretty clean. Yep, they take care of it here, yeah. second Saturday of the month they always had an arts and crafts festival here mm -hmm. uh, this little white building on the right here mm -hmm. uh, they redid that and there was some kind of business in it across the road uh, those buildings were redone and there were little buildings arts and crafts kind, kind of businesses in those and uh, I see they're all closed now. Yeah. And, uh... Yeah. What does that Delano, say? Brazil, Pottery. That was his building right there. I'll come back and get a photo of that so I can put it in the video. That's a paint. Well, all of them are closed up, yeah. aren't they? Yeah, see, a little park right there, honey. He, he was a professor of, was a music professor down at Valdosta State, I think, honey. Mm -hmm. But this, this was his home and he tried to revitalize it. But I see it didn't. That's a nice little house. Yeah, nice little house, yeah. We're going right across and then we're going to come back to the place the station up there which is where all of our farm sells their uh, oils honey it's just a little uh, residential community over here yeah. I don't think that there's anybody at that school honey I don't see any vehicles mm -hmm. and it is a school day you know they have a post office around here uh, I'm sure they do honey but I don't know where it's located Probably needs a little cleaning up, honey. Yeah, 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 That'd drive you crazy, wouldn't it? Yeah, if I had to look at it, it would. Yeah. Look at that. That looks like a fairly new house. Yes. But this is, uh, pits. Most of it, anyway. We're not 
not going to try to show everything. We might ride down here just a little bit, honey. I don't think that house there has any potential. That no, I think they've used all the potential out of it, honey. Still got the wind chime barely hanging on back there. It's a nice house right here on the right. And this is this is the edge of town right here, honey. Ninth Avenue. Ninth Avenue. It's not a bad little community. It's just. Like I said, it, it, it's heyday has been long past, you know. If you want peace and quiet, probably low crime, isn't it, around here? Well, I can't see anything here that I want to, to, to... I mean, what are they going to rob? Yeah. They don't have a bank here either? Not here, I don't think, honey. But they, they go into Rochelle. There's one in Rochelle. That's a cute house. Yes. There's a few. But some of them are, you know, they, they need updating a little bit. Did we see a Dollar General or not? No, I haven't seen a Dollar General, honey. But the, the Church of God was real large when I was here. I think it's kind of gone down some too since then. But we're going to stop up here at the what's called the station. I have to get a picture of that sign, honey. This is where you and I... Tim came, Tim. yes. Ooh, there's a truck coming. I saw it. Go ahead and talk. I guess we've had this now two years. You better talk to me. <laughs> <laughs> but we've let's see this July it'll be two years though that we've had this so um, that's exciting tell them of yours your name so my name yeah Valerie Oliver okay married to Clay Oliver and this is Oliver Farm Oliver right? Farm uh -huh. Artisan Oils yep. Artisan Oils okay and this is the station and this, so, this is where you sell them okay? that's right do you mind if I take a video around here I would here? love for you to alright yep Okay, thank you for your information. Welcome. I'm not a good camera. You did you did fine. 